Excuse me? Someone said he must be shitting a log. I took a piss, washed my hands, and got a sparkling water. That's ridiculous. Of course I washed my hands. Don't offend me. I'm not going to show you my hands. You wouldn't be able to see the germs on them anyway if there even were germs. Sapienza. Shakira, Shakira. You pee slow? Of all the things to be, you know, concerned morning, about. Percent. Your destination is the coastal town of Sapienza, also known as the jewel of the Amalfi Coast. Your target More like the Amalfi the Coast? Class, Silvio <coughs> Caruso, a brilliant but troubled bioengineer employed by the Ether Biotech Corporation. He dresses like a fucking bitch. Research, Can't wait to take that sweater off his back and put it on the helmet von Kruger. Project. A DNA specific virus able to infect anyone, anywhere in the world. Eliminate Silvio Caruso and destroy the yet unfinished virus prototype. You will also need to deal with Caruso's lab head, Francesca DeSantis, a high level ether employee and cutthroat corporate climber who holds intimate knowledge of Caruso's research and could potentially carry on in his place. This is no ordinary contract. What is Al Capone this wearing there? This is a serious threat to our craft and trade, not to mention our core ideals. So failure is not an option. And Al probably wishes he was sponsored by LaCroix. I would, but they're not sponsoring anybody, man. Oh, look at that suit, boys. It's gonna blend right in. Oh god, you look like Pitbull. <laughs> Welcome to Sapienza 47. Silvio Caruso's family home is right across the square. The bioengineer suffers from acute travel phobia, so the Ether Corporation has installed a state-of-the-art field laboratory somewhere... This dude's building a bullet that can infect you with a virus that kills you? He's afraid to get on a fucking airplane? Ah, oh, regionale prima, grazie, buongiorno. Subdue! Judo chop. I'm not gonna judo chop this lady, that just... Seems uncalled for. Let's take some time to explore here. Said Judo Chop! Never mind. Judo Chop. Ooh, there's some kind of opportunity going on over here. What's. Whoa, my lord! I don't really want to change out of this Pitbull suit. He's looking so trim. Hey, uh, Judo Chop! Uh, I mean, I'd rather not kill you if possible. Ooh, right, this is Buddy. Hello. Uh, you know, chop! Oh god, that, that... Okay, okay, this this one... Just start all over. This was a disaster. Hey, I'll take a large espresso, please. Hold the coffee. Suits only? Suits only! Wow. So rude. It's gonna be another stupid story, isn't it? Order a snack. Please tell me you can buy ice cream with only six coins. Are you crazy? In this economy? A lot of industrial espionage in the pharmacy. Can you come back in five minutes? I can come back whenever you want. I already got what I wanted. <clears throat> Didn't see me there. Oh, sorry. That was actually my bad. Oh! I recommended you to Chef Marcello personally. If he's unhappy with you, I'll get the blame. I could get fired. Is that what you want? Please. Want to wait on that weirdo Caruso for the rest? Time for me to become a waiter. This guy looks just like me. Please come in. Oh, ring a ding ding, baby. This dude's getting so subdued. This is my door. No one's coming. Pick up the proximity explosive. There's a gun. Oh no, it's an illegal item. <laughs> yeah, maybe if Hillary wins. We got a freaking chemistry set here. Explosive golf ball! Kitchen knife. One more for the collection. Golf ball is this level's sword. Ring-a-ding-ding, -ding, baby. 
Hey, Marcello, no need to do your waiter job anymore. I'm Pitbull. I'm taking you on my apprenticeship as the new Mr. Worldwide. Let me guess. Cause... Let me guess, Judo Chop. Ooh, mansion key card. Hell yeah, dog. Take the rest of his shit, too. I don't care. I'm not a business man. I'm a business man. Let me handle my business. Damn. Did you pick that card off with your ass? You don't even want to know. Hey, this guy's playing like Hitman Absolution or something. It's pretty cool. Ooh, another apartment key for me, for me. Won't let me view the intel there. A key to the apartment. Oh, that's fantastic news. Thank God everybody is pale and bald. Well, where'd she go? She was yelling at me. I'm supposed to go to the mansion. Yeah, do so. Oh, I'm... Don't you remember me? Hey, uh, idiot! I'm Marcello. Yeah? You hide like a little girl. And don't come back. Well, I bet she feels real smart. Mission accomplished. Ooh, expired can of spaghetti sauce! The perfect crime. God, idiot! I'm definitely going to kill one of these guys and take his uniform, though, because, uh... I need a new suit. I've been compromised. Ooh, little judo chop! Yeah, girl, drag him. Dope. This guy knows who I am as well. Oh, God, they all know who I am. There was a dead rat under my bunk this morning. Disgusting. Oh, Must mean the poison's Ooh, rat poison. That would be a, a first for the Hitman franchise. The perfect crime continues. Mansion Master Key! That strikes me as a positive thing. Hello. Kill someone with a golf ball so Happy learns to putt. It's just about the greatest goddamn idea I've ever heard. I gotta find a way to get his exploding golf ball onto the tee. Perhaps I could throw a can of spaghetti at his head? Just mow him down? You want me to gratata this poor man? Romantic note. Francesca DeSantis is evidently having an affair with Caruso's golf coach, Roberto Vargas. A notorious ladies' man, Vargas has turned DeSantis' bedroom into a candlelit love nest and plans to call on her after his golf lesson with Caruso. Well, she should know better than to mix business with pleasure. Put the golf ball into the can of spaghetti. And throw it at him. Pick up amputation knife. It's an illegal item. I'm gonna have to put that away. Hide as a plague doctor. This is the new el outfit from Helmet? Alright, we're gonna learn something here. Who would tell me to use Death Blossom and don't my old charged yet? We can drop that shit on his head? Yeah, it is me, Helmut. I've decided to learn medicine from the 13th and 14th century. Dude, fucking get over it. My left arm is hurting like crazy here. Yeah, it'll only take you about 25 years to write your uh, memoirs at that pace. Okay, we gotta be waiter again, temporarily. What's up, dude? I'm supposed to find out more about you. You're a notorious ladies' man, apparently. Ooh. Nah. What? And then a freaking judo chop! Alright, alright, alright. Huh? That was my bad. What about just turn this shit on? How you feel about that? Waste water. Pretty fucked up, right? Hmm. I just don't care. I just don't care, dude! 
the old water distraction trick works again. Don't fall down. I don't want to lose five thousand dollars. Ooh, more tools for the tool collection. Who left this on over here? That's not okay, man. Yo, people are dying. These droughts. Yo, this music is going crazy, dude. They've never seen the hitting of men like this. You're crazy for this one, Hove. Golf him? Throw the golf ball? Nah, we need him to swing at it. Pretend it's the shot put from London 2012? Alright, perfect. Hey, dude. Perfect crime, boys. I was pretty suspicious how a staff member put the golf ball into the golf ball bag. Seen something suspicious? Okay, so there's this guy. He's he's not what he appears to be. Do we have any what? Idea on the suspect? Um, the gentleman was white. He was bald. Uh, very strong looking. Yeah. The guy's trying to look like a guard. Leave it to me. That seems... Are you talking about a tall, bald man? Who's extremely pale? I don't think so. Okay. Don't forget the tribal tattoo. Look, dude, don't take this the wrong way, but a freaking... Uh, uh, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm not gonna kill you and become a gardener. I'm not gonna kill you and become a gardener. If we murder him, can we become the golf coach? Oh, this is awkward. Just listen to the conversation. Hey, Francesca. Alright, let's go play some golf, dude! Let's all go for a walk outside now. The summer sun comes my rain. I'm just this magazine is so glossy. Get the golf coach disguise. I need to convince him. Jeez, what the hell are you doing? Sorry, I'm just exploring. I thought I left some uh, Peking duck rolls in here. You know, I flew them in uh, from Lorenzo's in London. I'd like to judo chop you. This is going to be our moment. I'm not saying it's gonna be easy, but this is gonna be our moment. This guy's gotta go first. Hey, you get hurt sneaking around like that. <laughs> yeah, you don't even know the half of it, buddy. Yeah, that worked really well. I thought he was gonna do like a sweet Mugatu throw, but he just like overhanded it like Dr. J. The world's most silent gun. All right, we're probably gonna try that one all over again. You could get judo chop sneaking around like that. Hey, uh, dude, you know what time it is? I'm uh, hoping the store's still open so I can go get a judo chop. All right, that's how we're gonna do it in the future. Give it a sec. Give it a sec. Oh, excuse me, sir. Have you seen my dog? He's really small. He's uh, his breed. You wanna know his breed? His breed is a judo chop. Sounded just like a can of sounded just like a can of expired spaghetti. Wait a minute. Huh. Is that a plague doctor's knife? What the, what the hell? <laughs> 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 I did. <laughs> oh, 
running judo chop. This is uh, freaking judo. Excuse me? Being nice right now. I don't usually give second warnings. Hey, freak, drop what? the knife. This was. Don't do a running judo chop. The running judo chop was a bad decision. That's my fault. I didn't realize that guy was still awake. That's my bad. I'll learn from that experience. Here we go. Kate, your enchant. What are you going to play on your stream? I was thinking you might want to play a little bit of a freaking judo chop. You got a problem, mister. You got a problem. That's the secret. 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 Okay. Oh yeah. Hey, what's good here? I was thinking I'd have a side of the judo chops. Unlikely, sir. Sorry, there you go, okay. Hello. I am the golf coach. I would like to call the woman with whom I am having an affair. If we could just where's the where's the where's the phone? It's like somewhere over here. Pick up cell phone. It's me. Roberto. Silvio let you off early. I want us to meet. See you soon. I think we got this. Sit down as the Nicely golf coach. DeSantis will be here shortly. Might as well just steal like all of her stuff first if I haven't already. Just wasting energy for no reason. You roaring fireplace. You're in the Italian, you know, Amalfi Peninsula already. Spaghetti her? Put a coin in her drink? You think she's Austin? That is Francesca DeSantis. This weapon was just Lying around. People have to be more careful. Oh no, this is gonna be awkward. Don't oh god. Wait a minute. Ooh. Oh my god! Someone the freaking judo chop! I just found her like this. Okay. Okay, we gotta go back to Judo Chop Town. It's not working out. Oh, excuse me, sir. What I interest you in the school of Judo Chopping? Now it's time for Spaghetti Place. So, did you get my message? Hey, pick that up! I'm gonna go ahead and say this is probably not gonna work. Well, one thing's for sure. Like, the step one is this dude gets judo chops. That's not even debatable. Oh, fuck. Well, I guess I'm not gonna become the golf coach. It's me. Proximity mine the door? Just leave a bomb by her door? What if somebody else walks through it first? Step one, 100% judo choke. Throw a freaking can of spaghetti up here. Okay, let's see. Just wait right here. Yeah, oh, all right. Anyone there? You hear me? Freaking judo chop! Perfect crime. All right, now we gotta become the golf coach. He didn't wait right there, that's true, he did walk away. Just leave a trail of spaghetti cans. Just a trail of spaghetti. 
You think I ain't got coins too? Where are you going, dude? Yeah, sir. I just saw this. Look, I'm a pacifist, so I'm no expert, but I think it might be a weapon. You should look into it. Stay here. Uh, yeah, uh, okay. Yeah, whatever. What are you guys doing? It's the perfect time for the perfect crime. Oh God. Spaghetti Bandit strikes again. Man. Hey, got a sleeper. He, he was tall, bald, but it was the eyes. Cold as stone. He was disguised as the staff that works here. Oh, here. I just yeah, wanted I the phone. We're in luck. Victim ID the perp. Get this. White, no hair, badass. We're looking for a guy disguised as the house staff. Nope, no way. Freaking shoot on chop! I need the phone. I need the phone. That's the spaghetti. I need the phone. That's a coin. I need the phone. Maybe I already have it. Maybe I already have it. I don't already have it. Greatest spaghetti plays of all time. Spaghetti 2016. Well, pretty much, pretty much just gonna have to wait for this one to go down. However it goes, I guess. I guess now we should just leave. Huh? Stay put. I'll look into it. Do it. Helping yourself. Did the guy do? Did the guy die to the golf ball? Judo chop. Target down. Next up. Francesca DeSantis. Oh, oh my god! Is there anyone who can- Don't panic! How did they get through my trap? Probably this guy, huh? It's a tough life. She might be in the lab. Ooh, or she might not be. That's the other alternative. You still have to get the virus. Counter-Strike Global Offensive! No! Explosion kill. Oh right, he got killed by the golf ball. Okay, I remember now. Oh! I... Didn't expect to get into some combat immediately, but that's okay, Juno Shop. Be helmet or riot? Excuse me, how am I gonna be helmet on this mission? That would give me away in two seconds. There's no way Helmet Kruger would ever go to Sapienza. He's taking a little sleep in the Danube right now. And now, how do you say bagel? We're not doing that today, okay? We're not doing bagel nonsense. Oh, there she is. Would you date someone with a barcode on their head? Look, I'm not gonna say that I wouldn't necessarily, you know, in an alternate reality where I was, you know, single. But on the other hand, I will say that they'd probably need to have a pretty good explanation for it. Let's just leave it at that. Do we have coins? We do have coins. This lady loves coins. Excuse me? Wah! Man, watch your six. TJ Wad, thank you as well. Oh! Okay, she's done. I'm not gonna use instinct, but there's no other way for her to get out of here, so we know that she's taken care of. But we need her keycard to get into the base, I think. 
Watch her take a piss? Excuse me. This isn't that kind of show. I don't know what you've heard. Bought it, please, and man filled 94. Thank you. It's one judo chop! Oh, that was not a judo chop. We just punched her in the face. Entering the ether lab requires a key card and a uniform. Luckily, it seems both are within reach. Can we not disguise ourselves as her? Oh, you need to kill her. That's right. Oh! <laughs> judo choke. Um... You don't have the figure for that outfit? Well, I mean, I understand that, but... At the same time, you know, I'd, I'd like to wear the lab coat. It could be worse, right? I think people would notice that you're a dude. Yo, I've worn a lab coat before. You know where I bought my lab coat? Same place the female, uh, my female colleagues had their lab coats, dude. Campus bookstore. We are going to need to get a lab coat, but we can probably do that. They have the buttons on the opposite side. I don't believe that for a dang second. Campus bookstore is overpriced trash. Yeah, but you can't beat the location, dude. Alright, next objective. Found it. Next objective objective is to get a lab coat. I kinda wanna see what's going on up here. Hey guys. I think I've decided that that's not actually the way that I'd like to go. How the heck do we get into that ET tunnel over there? Okay, okay. This is like a true Austin Powers moment right here. There's a lab code. There's a lab code. But I'd like to find an isolated lab code. Surely there has to be somebody here who hates their job. Man, these guys are like... These guys are stacked up. Use blink? Those were the days. Okay, generator's been turned off. This guy comes up, and he goes like, Hey, that's weird. What's up with this generator? And then we take his outfit, and we can get close enough to get a lab coat. And then... Oh, fuck. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you! That should never have happened. I'm Sam Fisher. I'm just walking around. The place is very strange. I don't know. It's my first day on the job. All right, all right, load it up. Judo load. I mean, I guess there's another way over here. Let's go explore this. It's all about the puzzle box, right? I see a little drain pipe there. Drain pipe is like stealth game language for this is the way that you're supposed to go. Oh, excuse me, sir. Do you mind if I roll neat? Dude, I don't want to get rid of this sick pattern shirt, though. I don't want to be the Louis Vuitton Don who's signing off. Judo! Judo! Judo, exit the cover. And you smack him on the head and you judo choke him. Now we should stand up, right? Because, like, we're supposed to be holding shotguns down here. Just want to see if maybe there's a chance for us to get a lab coat here. Nope. We could murder that guy for, like, no reason. What's that thing in the bottom left of the screen? I see it's a mini-map, okay? I'm just doing some exploration here to try to figure it out for myself. You know, some people play this game with the mini-map off for true immersion. These guys do not recognize me? Probably be a little weirded out by me just walking around like this, but... Rat poison? Always gotta have some rat poison. Obviously, you have to steal a wrench. This is our lab coat, 100%. Does this game have rat shadows? Maybe that's Dishonored's problem, is that it has rat shadows. Ooh, you think you can escape from that plane? I would almost guarantee it. Video games love letting you escape in airplanes. It's like a universal truth. Just a typical scientist sort of thing here to skirt your way around the edge. Hey, what's up, dude? Just checking, just checking. Well, I don't know, maybe we could start the alarm here. 
and then walk around. Like, is the scientist gonna look for this? That sort of worked? We're at a critical stage of development, and we keep the central lab perpetually doused in chemicals. In case of an outbreak. Yes. He's a scientist? They make too much money to go scout? Honestly, these security guys probably make more money than the scientists. The air purification system clears the toxin, so you can enter without a hazmat suit. Okay, that's a hint. You don't need a hazmat suit, but if you're fast... Or if you're if you're slow, you might die. Who are we even trying to kill? We're trying to stop these jokers from killing the whole human race. Turn on the ventilation system. Pick up security protocol. You guys okay? According to the safety protocol, the air inside the central lab is highly toxic and entering requires a hazmat suit. However, the air recycling system on the control platform can temporarily clear the toxins. Okay, so we've cleared the toxins so that we can enter the room without a hazmat suit. You should be intimidated by lab coats, my man. So if we can only stabilize the cell structure to survive for... Just gotta wait it for that guy. It's a really important skill to have as a man who hits. To know who will recognize you and who won't. Now, if, if you don't mind, I'm just gonna sneak through here without you noticing me. She's too engrossed in her work. Hey guys, what's up? Okay, these guys like definitely notice me. Alright, I'm sorry, like I didn't mean to be here. Oh, come on. Did you have to? You're supposed to put the rat poison in the soup to poison the virus? We need to maybe be wearing an orange hazmat suit to go in there and not be uh, so suspicious. Just use the explosive golf ball? I already used the explosive golf ball, man. Destroy virus. Missing biolab laptop dongle. A clipboard with the lab's safety protocol. To prevent a disastrous outbreak, a kill switch has been installed. One push of a key and the virus instantly overheats and dies. However, it requires an access dongle. And the scientist who holds this dongle has left a note that reads, Gone to church. So I'm assuming that if we actually exit into the town, there's probably a church that we can find and then we can take his dongle? Hey guys. I don't understand what they're talking about, like, NDAs. Like, you're already, you're doing something super illegal. I'm pretty sure that the NDA doesn't mean Jack if you're like, well, you can't talk about the uh, illegal virus we're making. Ooh, what's going on under here? I'm assuming you will probably still... Oh, there we go! That is the ticket right there. We're in hazmat suit country. This poor fuck has no idea what is coming his way! I'll tell you one thing, it's a little judo joke. Well, on the one hand, they revealed their plans to uh, destroy planet Earth with a virus that could kill all human beings, but uh, on the other hand, they violated the terms of their NDA. So sorry, but you have to go to jail. Hazmat suit. Now, just to stay in keeping with the theme, I think we should have to, you know, decontaminate ourselves before we go into the clean room. This is how you know the developers care, because they actually gave you the option to do this. Thank you, IO Interactive. You have been recorded by a camera, that is correct. These guys will not recognize me. Okay, can't do that, just checking. As far as I'm concerned, you know, all these scientists, sure, maybe you think they're just doing their damn jobs, but uh, they're being like extreme assholes as far as I'm concerned. So, you know, they, if they die, that's collateral damage. 
Of course you can't do that. Maybe it's just a... Wait, if I just do this... Maybe it's just a... It's an extra recording device. It's a... It's a mass spectrometer. What's up, y'all? Just fellow science... Man doing science things in the clean room. I suppose I could just, you know, shoot it. That's one way to do it. We could turn on the ventilation system. Why not? That's something scientists do. Hey, let's ventilate this thing. I don't really want to poison the rats. That seems needlessly cruel, right? I thought maybe... I don't, I don't know what I was thinking. Yeah, no kidding. It's a virus prototype. Poison the rats? Why do you want me to poison the rats? They haven't done anything wrong. Put a mine on the rat cage. If you poison the rats, they'll leave the station. I can see that. I just feel bad for them, you know? Go fast, go fast, go fast. Uh, increase temperature. Yeah, why not? You killed the rats for no reason? No, I got the dude, uh, it got the dude away. NL is a god, inconspicuous. Now we just have to escape. I'm actually mad that worked. Why you have to be mad? This only game. I don't think they were onto me. Just go, just go. He became a rock. What's up with that? See you in hell. Oh! Thank God I got my pilot's license on weekends, baby. See you later, Sapienza. Is the perfect crime. Remember how I got the. Uh, Zero dollars on our last mission? I think we did better this time. I can afford. Boss is unhappy. I guess when you're invisible, you stop looking over your shoulder. Yeah, because yeah, you don't even know where your shoulder is. How are you supposed the to look over exposed it? You. I see how you did the heavy lifting. I just pulled some strings. Yeah, you're mine. How do you expect... I play dirty. Now give me Realism? Sorry for the mystery sub, thank you. Won't do much good. And TBABB13? Thank you, messenger. Don't. I just killed you. Then we're even. The, like, texture quality on these cutscenes is kind of ridiculous. I mean, I'm playing it at a 720p windowed, so we're losing maybe a little bit of fidelity, but still. I don't think we killed any non-targets. All right. Hey, total scores 61 four, 63. We got two two hitmen tribal tattoos. I'll accept that. And we also got zero penalties. So as far as I'm concerned, that's a huge increase over like our last mission. The rats weren't a target. <laughs> Let's see how we did relative to our friends here. Oh, sorry, Mathis. Try to get close and your ass will get smacked. My homie Snoop Doggy Dog has got my back. How does it feel to get beat literally, uh, infinity fold? It's honestly a little embarrassing for you, Mathis, but, you know, so be it, I suppose.